What an absolutely awesome morning to be down here working on the river again, guys. We are gonna hopefully get our boat dock project completely wrapped up today. The piling is drove, the backfill is done, the concrete is poured. All we got left to do is to get this hillside cleaned up and uh, that's gonna be a wrap. Let's make it happen. All right, man, behind the scenes. You ready for my vision on this? As long as it matches mine, I'm ready for it. No sand volleyball court. Ah, oh, man. You used to be a professional volleyball player. Could you now. imagine playing beach volleyball down here with all this rip rap and rock around? Let's get rid of it all. No. All sand. <laughs> Sand's softer right. than rocks. Oh, uh, yeah, but sands don't stay put whenever the river gets really bad. <laughs> you got plenty of time. You can fix it. Yeah. All right, so this... I don't know if you guys see the videos all the way back when we drove the sheet piling and backfilled this in, but the, the water line used to be like back into there. That used to be the river bank. That is no longer the case anymore. So I think what we need to do to make this as accessible as possible mm -hmm. and fortify it the best we can for the river, I say we take all this rock, work it down and make it, basically make like a riprap line right here. So we'll, we'll kind of fill in this area right here with all that extra rock. Okay. Uh, and then we'll take that and kind of just slope it down to here and then that'll all be grass so basically we'll have a grass strip that goes up through the park and i like that and then future plans we'll go my route volleyball probably not highly unlikely if it makes you happy this morning i'll agree with you until we're done okay but highly <laughs> unlikely so all right, I think first things first, let's, uh, I think first things first, we need to get this section done first. What do you think? Yeah. Uh, get that. I wonder if I can set it up around the top with a 120. You think you can take that dozer and push that rock down to me without busting up the concrete? Uh, I think so. I think I can do that. All right, because if I can sit right there and you just kind of push that rock to me, that would be ideal. All right, let's make it happen. All right.
No, no, don't look too bad. I just back straight up and get underneath that pile and go again. Yeah. Touch your blade the other, touch your blade the other way. I don't know. There you go. Down. Up a little bit. Trail looks good and solid back there. Get that over here far enough to us. We'll grab it with the track, I'll swing her up. I should be good there.
a drop back away from the concrete and help me out a little bit. That way we ain't got to worry about uh, damage and everything. I hate to twist and turn down here with that dozer any more than what we have to cause any problems. I can fish some of these bigger rocks out of here and get them where I want. See how far this rock gets me, then we'll know which way we need to go with that rock. It's looking a lot better doing that. We may need a, another bucket, uh, maybe two buckets, but I think that's making it look a lot better up here. Well, man, behind the scenes, that looks. You gotta show them my fine work I did. That looks awesome. Your footwork. <laughs> Oh, footwork, look. Yeah. look, you missed one. I'll get it for you though, oh. don't worry. No, no, what I was gonna do was get the leaf blower. Oh, you're gonna save out for yeah. the leaf blower. Yeah. My bad, my bad. No, that looks good. I got the uh, bigger rocks down here, kind of got everything locked in with the smaller rocks. We do need to take the leaf blower, we'll wait till the end to do that. Yeah. But that looks way better. So, all right, I think we're on to the next part here. I don't think we need any more material this way, do you? No, I think we got plenty in here. I say we take the bigger stuff, push it down that way. I'll bring the smaller stuff down, kind of as some fill, and then hopefully we can find some good dirt up here on the hillside and kind of cap everything off. Yep. And uh, see what she looks like. You ready to make her happen?
brought some big ones up. Got it looking pretty good. Get it done much better myself. <laughs> I have no doubt. Maybe one little bit's left in there. We need to just kind of skim off and try to use it as fill. Yeah. Uh, hopefully, we get down to some really good dirt. We can top everything off. That sounds good. Uh, I guess you want to go do that. No, I had one thing. Not to critique things, but I just noticed we should have saved a little bit of them twos. On this other end down here. Yeah, right there. Up with some, uh, debris, we can debris we can put in there. All right, that sounds good. We'll All right. No problem.
it's starting to give us a pretty good visual of what we're gonna have. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. yeah I don't know I if we get it. I fast. think we've got, I mean, there's a few random rocks that pop up here and there, but I think we're getting the majority of them buried, yeah. ain't we? The, uh, the old AMI ruckus wreck will find the rest of them. Oh, yeah, it will. <laughs> I say, uh, we think just kind of keep on going, get that all roughed in there, mm -hmm. and then we'll uh, ruckus wreck it out. Yep. All right, we'll do it. Well, what do you think? <clears throat> Man, it's coming together. That laid in there nice, didn't it? Yeah, it did. Holy cow, that laid in there good. Yeah, and you realize that on the park, this is going to be the easiest tail to mow. <laughs> 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 it almost makes you want to finish up some sort yeah. of like, I mean, you could pretty much continue that on across if you yeah. want to. Yeah, you could. You think do the whole dock next phase? Is that like phase two? Just gonna, you know, yeah. <laughs> I think we're running low on money and volunteers yeah, for that. So, yeah. <laughs> all right. I think, uh, man, we got most of the rock buried. Yeah. I was uh, think we had a little overkill bringing the bigger dozer in, but it made pretty short work of it. We're yeah, pretty dude. good. So, all right. All right. As I was saying before, my camera died. We got the AMI ruckus rake on the DL550. We're gonna come down here and make a few quick passes on this and get her cleaned up real nice. And then, uh, yeah, throw some seed and straw on her. And uh, hopefully it rains. It's getting a little late in the season to be planting grass, but we're gonna, we're gonna hope for the best. start backing over them now.
looking like your air conditioner is working. No, it ain't, it ain't working. <laughs> <laughs> There's a nice cool river over here. You go yeah, I know it. Oh, it's tempting, but uh, getting it set up, I mean, it's just about right for that volleyball court. <laughs> <laughs> I went over at one point, even sunbathing on a rock like a turtle. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, they, you know, I hit 40 and it, it's like it's not a old man sport anymore with a shovel. <laughs> my lower back, tell you what, I think my lower back's about 72. Oh, is that how it works? Yeah. You, different, yeah. you got different body parts, different them, ages? Then from there, there up, I'm about 23. <laughs> no comment. All right. I don't know what else we can do, but we probably should show them how dressed up I got that. Yeah, so we'll, let's go show them. Let's go take yeah. him a tour. There's a couple little spots, but uh, it, it'll be fine. So Aaron came down through here with a shovel and did one hell of a job. Got all the dirt worked up next to the concrete. Looks really good. <coughs> Got everything blowed off. It's, uh, man, it's turned out even better than I thought it was going to. Yeah. I said we grab some lunch. Somebody's not happy with it, you tell them come talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. I guess we need to cross our fingers and hope that our repairs we made on the straw blower the other day work. Yeah. Yeah, this is going to be a trial and error on it. Yeah, we're going to have to use the little tractor because the other ones are all tied up. Yep. All right, let's grab some lunch, grab a straw blower, and get this done. paint job I've ever seen. I like it. I'm pretty proud of whoever done it. Let's hope your PTO shaft works. I can't see. Oh, sorry. Can you see now? Oh, I gotta go down more. Maybe you can't see. I can't see. I can see right through the pedal hitch into that though. That part works. Yep. It was the paint. It was the paint? Hey. <laughs> That's kind of what we were afraid of. See how this is kind of the same height as that? The other track that we normally use has got a little bit of a difference, but I don't think it's enough to make a difference. So, as pretty as what that is, I think we're gonna have to cut it off. I know. I hate to, but. Purple paint. Yeah, yellow. purple paint. That's what it is. Yeah, yellow paint. Everyone's doing that. Man, it looks so good until it didn't work. Oh well. Maybe some you lose some. Hey. You ready for take two? Now that you got wet paint everywhere. Wet paint. I got no wet paint anywhere. How'd you know where the paint was at if you didn't paint it before? It took me about 20 minutes to find it to <laughs> yeah. paint that up, yeah. All right, I'll see if we can get the drive shaft on. There we go. There we go. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Jesus, it's hot in here. Yes, it is. I think I'll take a load of the trailer. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't blame you there. That's 12. I think that'll be a good start. What do you think? Uh, as long as I count it right, yeah, I think so. We'll find out. You know how to use that sophisticated piece of equipment? Oh, uh, it ain't it hooked up to a piece of machinery. There's, there's so. no PTO shaft on that one. It's a manual crank. Just pull this trigger and run it wide. Well, you got. Like you can you walk, crank, and pull all at the same time? Oh, something's right. Dragging. What am I hitting? Your, uh, oh, your, your I didn't do that. Thing right here. Yep. There, see, it's on the wrong side. Mile That's your right. adjustment on how far. Hold on, you, you got it. Where? You gotta get you a little more seed yeah. there. You go. Now you're ready now to I go. I should be able to pull the trigger and go, right? Yeah. Oh, look yeah. at you go. You know, Better watch out, old Steve over here is gonna pass you up. I don't, he's a young guy. Yeah, young guy like 74. Ah, uh, he ain't 74. I think he is. Huh? I <laughs> don't see that, me genius. You guys are doing good. Keep up the good work. Yeah, you just keep walking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Seeds down. Fertilizer's Great. down. Fertilizer's down. Look, I made you another uh, improvement here. You got a steerable handle now. <laughs> you like that? Yeah, I do like that. We'll uh, see how your grading here works out too. Yeah. All right.
love it. it. Looks good. Man, I don't know how that could have turned out any better. That is. Yeah. Do you guys go all the way back and watch the videos of us driving this steel wall, steel wall, and the videos of us hauling all this material in here with Bubba Dump? Yeah. And then skip forward to this video now. I don't think you'd believe the transformation. Yeah. No. No. It's crazy, ain't it? it? Was, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's uh, man, we got all this all rip wrapped and put back. Looks great. Got all the groundwork done. Got seed down, got fertilizer down, got straw down. Mike's up there on sprinkler duty. They're getting it watered. We've already got boats docking. Yep. It's uh That's what we should be doing. I know. We should have been doing that like three, four hours. We gotta go dock some equipment though. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but man, oh man, we should walk all the way down to the other end and check it out. And it just What's next? This project's done. We gotta figure out something else to do down here now. Yep. What was it last year we did the big sail project up there this year was the boat dock project a couple years ago was the building a couple years before that was the boat dock our boat ramp but this in here turned out really nice also so this should come down through here and drain out around there or drain out down through this riprap here whichever way it decides to go when the river comes up it's probably going to deposit some sediment in here and it may change its path so we'll have to tweak it a little bit but other than that i think it'll be good yeah i like it man it looks awesome so so you brought up some great ideas that uh we are going to do in the future or you are going to do in the future oh what happened to yeah. the we uh, well the we the you the <laughs> i think the next project is going to be doing something with that yeah so you're thinking like you know getting it leveled out making a walkway over to it making a gazebo yeah, we out actually, of it we actually shot that one time and if if you cut that off level it's almost the same as that so you can put a walkway out to it and have like a little bird's yeah. eye perch oh, gazebo we need to put a gazebo we need a ceiling pan it goes there. underwater oh so you can't get too carried away we'll build it out of metal <laughs> it'll stay <laughs> i beams will work you know a welder huh you know a welder, a welder. yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, he's a retired boiler maker. <laughs> <laughs> no comment. All right. All right, guys. That is officially a wrap on this project. This would be absolutely impossible without uh, some major donations and a lot of volunteer help. This is yeah. well over a $100,000 endeavor for the community, all done with volunteers and uh, private donations. So everybody will get to enjoy it yes if you guys don't know derby is actually a little bit of a tourist town we got a lot of cabins around here and uh, our market and a few of the other businesses around here kind of depend on the river and the tourist and uh hopefully this will attract a few more towns though if you guys got a boat want to come check it out come on to derby indiana i agree with just tell them don't forget to stop at the derby market get their ice cream ice yep. and beer first yeah exactly so and you know that's... it's getting to the end of the week whenever i'm stuck drinking your drink because i'm is. out of Pepsi's. the end of the week <laughs> <laughs> all right You're guys own, that's a wrap Thanks for watching. If you liked it, give her a big old thumbs up. Want to make sure you don't miss out on what we're getting into next. I like to consider subscribing if you haven't already. We're out of here. You see this? Merry Christmas. It's not. That's when you'll show, they'll <laughs> see it. <laughs> well, you got to tell, tell them what today is then. Huh? Today's what? June 1st? June 1st, yeah. So they'll see it at Christmas. Not see, oh my goodness. We're out of here. <laughs>